Yeah, I mean, I would say that most horses have some degree of high-low because a lot of times it's like a dominant limb. A lot of times the the more dominant or, or heavily used limb will have a, a more low platter foot because it's mm. weighted more. And then the limb that they off weight or the one that they're, you know, not using as much will be more upright, um, smaller. And after a young age, when the coffin bone has fully formed, mm. they're not going to change the shape of their foot because mm. they, you know, their, their hoof follows the shape of their coffin bone. So mm. as an adult, there's only, uh, for a horse, there's only so much you can do to change the actual appearance of the high low. Mm -hmm. But that doesn't mean that they should have soundness issues from it necessarily. I don't try to force feet to look the same because that's when you can often end up causing problems. Because if this horse has a more upright or clubby foot and you're trying to force it to have a lower heel more than what that horse can handle, you're going to put extra strain on the check ligaments or mm -hmm. Um, you know, there's, there's a lot of knock on effects, the DDFT, um, those joints that are just going to be not able to handle that shift in weight bearing. Mm -hmm. Um, but my goal is to get their feet comfortable based on their own confirmation. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, sometimes the owner does need to get like a body worker in because mm -hmm. if they're not traveling evenly, they're going to exacerbate that handedness that brings mm -hmm. out the high low, um, so body work can really help with that. And then sort of working sympathetically with the foot to what that horse's comfort can allow. Mm -hmm. And as long as I do that, and I'm not going to say that I'm trying to think if there's a case where I have had issues. Um, most of them have been pretty good where they're sound and they're really happy and they're able to do all the owner wants to do as long as I'm not trying to force their feet to look the same. Mm -hmm. um, but a lot of times you can get a degree of change in both front feet where they start to match a little bit more because mm -hmm. they are traveling more evenly because they're comfortable. Yeah. Um, but my goal is never to make them look the same. My goal mm -hmm. is to get the horse sound, but I don't, I guess I'm sure. I I'm sure like if anybody's listening who has like a very severe high low case, that's just really struggling um, that there are ones that soundness becomes a problem, but I've had some really crazy horses that have like, one very clubby foot. And if I don't try to like change that too much, they're okay. Mm -hmm. 